guys, welcome to Lisa Marvin Art. I've already been painting all day because I'm ramping up my videos because I'm going on vacation. And my last video, I did a really pretty landscape bloom. And the colors really gave me an inspiration because what I layered was um, Prussian blue and I layered a TLP tail feather on top. It was so gorgeous. And then I did a swipe with TLP uh, sea glass, ball gown, and the Prussian blue. That was also beautiful. So I think we're just gonna do that. We're just gonna have fun because um, I used this, I was doing transfer swipes and I used this to do the transfer swipes and I have to use it now. So might as well just do like, just a quickie little bloom, nothing crazy. And I guess we're gonna go blues and I guess I'm gonna want the background to be the Prussian blue and the tail feather. So let's see, I have not prepared actually anything, which is pretty silly of me. Why don't I just do that? Like, and a simple like bloom vine, like, you know, and I'm not even, I'm just gonna go straight like this. You know what I mean? Now the pillow I have is majestic purple. You can see I've been painting all morning. <laughs> Having fun, I'm getting a lot of ideas and I'm not even, um, you know, done with all my ideas. Okay, so for the Prussian blue, I don't need it that thick. Uh, I can thin it out just a bit. Because it's going to be my faux pillow. You know? Oh, was that a bloop? It's hard to tell at this point. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Technically, I could just use... TLP, I mean, anchors away. I don't even know if we're gonna see the purple, whatever, we're not even thinking about anything. We're just like having fun. Okay. So that could be like a faux situation. Like faux pillow, I don't know. I'll stretch it out a bit. There are air bubbles that are gonna bug me, of course, but whatever. We'll go a bit this way. You know, sure, we'll go with this way. We don't really care because we don't really know what's happening just yet. Maybe I should at least give it over the corner, you know? Okay, I don't know. That's something, right? Now, hold on, I see a bloop. I don't want no bloop, okay? And I do see annoying air bubbles. Right? Buble, buble, buble. Okay. So now you say to yourself, what are you doing? And I'm going to say, I have no idea. So I have this on top here. I will need to start with a tube paint. So why don't I just start with whatever I've got going on here? Um, this is a color I've made myself, one of my smoky perps. Don't know exact Mundo what's in here. Just got a little thick. Um, but it's most likely like a diox purple and a red. Just watch some of my videos to see how I mix it. Are we doing a bloom vine or is that boring? Um, whatever. Let's do it. You know? Okay. So we have that. And you know what that reminded me of? Over here, I have... TLP Violet Rain, which is quite warm, just a bit. Again, we don't know what we're doing. Why don't I, oh, you know what I have? Triart Graphite Gray, gorgeous. You can get Triart at Fluid Art Company very shortly, if not now, okay? We're just like laying down paints. We don't know what's about to happen. What I do know is I'm gonna to top off with the Prussian blue and white cell activator. So why don't I add uh, TLP ball gown. I'll do ball gown, sea glass, and then the Prussian blue and blow it out and see what happens. This could be like really fun or really bum. <laughs> okay, ready? Where did it go? I think of it. I think the colors are pretty. So I have my white cell activator. Okay, are you ready? Okay. I 
don't know what colors we got going on here. It's not bad though. And what if I super stretch it out? Well, first I can spin to see where we're at. Like there's some annoying things that I dropped, like the pillow, I mean the cell activator there. Some cool cells. Should I stretch it out a bit or should I spin it? Hmm, questiones. I don't know. Let's do it. Do diddly do. I could, ooh, it's kind of pretty. Okay, let's start spinning and see what happens. I have so many paints open because I just keep getting, I don't have ADD, but it's like, I feel like, it seems like I do because I just get like all these ideas. You know what I mean? Okay. Now I don't want to wonk it up too much, but I do want to stretch it. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's going to wonk it up too much. Unless I go super slow. Let's see. Do I have the patience? I might. No. Okay, a little bit. Really slow. Really, really slow. Slow, really. I'm like tilting it so slow you can't even tell it's moving, but it is. <clears throat> Cause I wanna try to get, and there's like some air bubbles that are bothering me. So let's see, I'm going super duper slow. We can discuss about life while I'm doing this. Um. Do we like the colors? We don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna try to get that line of cell activator across without wonking it out too much, <clears throat> or at least try to get it to the edge so it spins off. Cause I have to go the other way. Yeah. I don't like, hmm. I don't like the shape that's happening to be honest. Like I don't like what's happening at the bottom right now or the top. So why don't I bring it back and then try to spin it? Ooh, did I? No, I don't like, I don't think I like what's happening. All right, let's try to go back and then at least so, and then we'll discuss the colors and what I've done. Let me just at least get this off. Okay. Oh, the white part's going to come off. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Uh, I hate these. Those are ghosts, you know, like, ah, help me. Yeah, no, I don't like what's happening. So let's discuss. What don't I like? Once I get this point part off, we'll just, we'll talk about it. Um, I don't think I like the purples with these cool colors. And you know what? I rarely mix such cools and warms but I think that's exactly what's throwing me off. So I'm gonna do a redo. Do you see what I mean? Like, look at that, so pretty. But the warm purples are just like making it look really yucky and brown. And that's not the look we're going for, is it? So now the other option is I could use a different base paint, but I don't think I need to. I can fix it. How much paint have we got left? Hmm. It's a shame to, to waste everything I've done, but, or should I? Hmm. Okay, what if I don't wanna waste, just for fun, okay? So normally I would just pour over it, but what if I'm just gonna like go for it again, okay? Now normally, as I said, I would put pillow paint down first, but I might have enough paint and then I can like skewer and do what I want. I'm gonna change my gloves because I'm dripping everywhere. Okay, uh, did I not even? I thought I put sea glass down, but maybe I didn't. Um, See what we got here, right? What is this? This is not, it's 
see last. Hmm. Lisa's losing her mind. Oh, the sea glass is right here. So what do we think this is? This could be a color I made. See the difference? I could tell because piggies are so sparkly. Okay, so we did that. We're going to go sea glass. Okay. We're going to try to pretend that that never happened. Um, why don't I go um, twinkle interference? So that's like a violety bluish interference. So we're going cool colors. Um, then this is a, mm, no, I don't like that color. It's a little, mm. do you know what? This is a cell activator. It looked a little thin, weird. I don't even remember what that is, but there you go. Um, what other blue? I mean, I got some blues. I'm just nervous to, what's this blue? This is another blue. Hold on, something just dropped in there. Um, let's try this blue. You're gonna ask me what it is, and unfortunately, I can't really tell you. I think it's one of the new blues that I've just purchased. Okay, are you ready? We're going again. I do love these colors together. If not, we're just gonna start from scratch, you know? Yeah. I forgot not to blow, blow so hard because I don't have a lot of pillow. See how it won't blow far? But, I get something cool looking. Probably not though. Actually, this is kind of cool. It is busy, but there are some cool things happening. Okay, while this, this is gonna set, I don't, like I like this look. It's definitely different, but I don't think I can pull it off with what's going on. Um, I love these colors together. It's very like kind of tight I look, but not, I don't think we can save it. It's quite busy. How much paint do we have left? Not much. I'm gonna have to like skewer it where it is and then hope for the best. Are you ready? There's so much going on here. I'm going again though with these colors. They're really cool. It's just this is not it. So I'm just trying to like see if little shapes can do anything, which I don't think it can, to be honest. You know. Uh, I should have abandoned ship. There is paint left though. I mean, I'm gonna spin it out and then we're gonna go again anyways. Um, I do like the blue colors that I did, at least we know that. Like, there's just too much insanity happening um to be anything good just hurts my eyeballs you know but let's at least look at the blues and i'll put away my other paints that we've been using as it spins around i'm gonna just keep spinning at this point we're not gonna lose anything Okay, guys, so A, my phone died after that, but that's okay. B, I wanted to continue the video, but Elliot wanted to work out, and our um, workout machine is in the same room as my studio, and he listens to loud music. So the rest of 
the video I'll be narrating with music in the background. I hope it's not too annoying, but it'll be kind of fun because I'll definitely critique myself and I've never really been able to do that. So this is also a really good progression because where I end up at the end of the video is nowhere where we kind of began. So this is kind of how I develop color combos. You just kind of got to go with the flow and see what you got. So there you have the lemon sorbet. Um, and let's just see what I do. Oh, there was a little bloop in there. So I got the bloop out. I hope this isn't the most boring narration ever. And I'm like, oh, pushing that paint, pushing that bloop. And then I'm like to myself, what is that? Now I've got to fix, maybe I'll just do squigglies. So I think I decide to do a few squigglies to see what's gonna happen. There I am, squiggle wiggle. Okay. <laughs> Sometimes I do like just dropping paint. Uh, and squiggling it about. Look at that. Those are some really good skewer skills, I have to say. Six out of 10 for sure on that one. I'm gonna, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna rate everything that I do in numbers. Okay, so there, that color is a black, a bone black. By the way, that color I put down isn't lemon sorbet. That first one was ball gown. Although they do have a very similar gold tone on a dark color. Let's see what else I'm gonna do. Hmm. Oh, there's the tail feather. Maybe the first one was lemon sorbet and that one's ball gown. I think there's lemon sorbet and ball gown going on. And there's the sea glass. Cause I'm not giving up on that combo over the ball gown and the sea glass, so pretty and the Prussian blue. Yeah, this is real interesting, all right. How do you guys watch me all the time? I guess because I'm talking like as I'm doing it, so it's more interesting. <laughs> Don't worry, the next videos that I do, I'll speed them up a bit. Okay, there's my white cell activator. Let's see how she blows. Okay, good start. Uh, lots of pillow, fail. Didn't blow hard, fail, pillow, fail. Look at that, that was a horrible blow. Did you see how that first blow got caught? There, I'm trying to fix it. Can I fix it? No, right into the pillow. Yeah, so sometimes if your paints are too thick, that will happen. You know how I hate pillow blows, but um, you know what? Over a darker pillow, I don't hate them as much. Especially if you have sparkles, they look kind of flowy, but I was not and I said, you know what? I might as well just squiggle the crap out of this because what a horrible little blow I just did, you know? So I'm trying to squiggle it. Now, I, to be honest, I don't love modified blooms because I'm a perfectionist. I know as a perfectionist, the reason I'm squiggling them is because it's not a perfect bloom. So I said to myself, why? See, you didn't do a perfect bloom. Now you got to squiggle it out but I'm just very hard on myself <laughs> because they are pretty. Cause you know what? I kind of, I think I like the end result of this. We'll see in a minute. Um, but sometimes it can it look flowy, but I try not to overdo it, but then I end up overdoing it. Obviously I like that squiggle to the left there, the bottom. It looks kind of pretty like a rose or something. Did I end up? I think I did end up keeping this. Don't worry. I mean, a worry if you don't like it. I don't know if you guys will like it or not. We'll see in a moment. At least you know, in the light when I show you the sparkle, you'll like the sparkle. People always ask me why my final product, when I say bring you to the light is so different, because the lights that I'm working on when I'm doing this are very cool white light. Oh, here she is. Okay, so look at the sparkle. Okay, I like that little shape there. Kind of looks like a rose. Is there too many squigglies, do you think? I don't know. I mean, I kept it, so I don't know. You'll tell me. Okay, next one. What am I gonna do? We are doing color to go anchors away and putting her down. <sighs> I don't know. So I wonder what am I gonna change? Hmm. All right, so I got ball gown down 
okay gold interference tlp then i'm gonna do some bone black very interesting uh oh yeah some sea glass always a winner yep okay we got the triart graphite gray now i'm going to be very harsh with judging my blow we got tlp tail tlp tail feather you guys will let me know if you like this voiceover or if it's tedious because either way i'm going to be speaking i speak endlessly right so but at least this way i can judge myself <laughs> All right. I believe that's TLP Twinkle, which is a really pretty, like, violety blue interference. Then we got the Prussian blue, and I think we're ready to blow. Oh. Here we go. All right, we're going to judge that blow. You gotta do a better job than last time. All right, you got it, and okay. So I've decided I was blowing too hard, so I'm blowing a little lighter, and you can tell not a lot of that pillow is coming up. So I adjusted my blow. Now, you see there's still a lot of white happening. That could mean my cell activator is a tad too thick. Because those big white things aren't really going to sink that much. It'll just be quite white. But the lacing is looking good. But let's see what happens when we spin her out. All right. There we go. So you got some really good lacing down the side. But then there's like just big white splotches on top. But look, I just want to show you that sparkle there. Really beautiful golds that that ball gown is giving off, which we love, gold and blue. Always look nice. And yeah, I should have probably thinned out my cell activator, but guess what? Even though that's kind of cool, I decide to trash it. And it's so funny because I've, I really trash a lot lately, especially because I have so many mediocre paintings around. And then sometimes when I rewatch re them, I say, why did I trash that? And then sometimes I keep some that I think are really nice. And then I go back and I say, oh, those are mediocre. So I never do the right thing. So I decided this time to start with TLP Lemon Sorbet. A hit pop of yellow at the bottom. Are you guys mad? Should I have trashed that or kept it? Okay. And then we have some... We're putting that Prussian blue down at the bottom. It's interesting to see how... I mean, for me, to see how my color combos kind of... Um, that's twinkle tlp twinkle um how they evolve from each piece so i learn each time i do something what i liked and what i didn't like and that's just kind of what you got to do so this is a cool purple um either it's like a diox purple or it could be a purple i made but it's more of a dox purple when i started i did the warm purples and it didn't really go well so I'm liking this more cool tone purple. On top of that, why don't we do some ball gown? And then we have the black. All right, do you think my blow is gonna get better? Let's see. All right, good first start. All right, there we go. Mm-hmm, oh, it got stuck there. 
All right, keep blowing. Nope, got stuck again. Oh, good, I saved that one. Mm-hmm, blow, yep. By the way, I'm gonna do another blowing video very soon, because um, I have more tips. <laughs> but obviously, well, they're not really working this time, but you know. All right, I even that up. Yeah, get that little piece there. Get it, there you go. All right, not so shabby. What I do, I'm gonna do a close up because these cells are really cute. Look at that. So we're looking very jewel toned, kind of cool. There is a lot of lemon sorbet happening. For some reason I went really overboard. Um, so it, it has taken over. So the edges are kind of cool, but the middle is very distracting. So guess what happens to her? She goes to the garbage and we try again. Now, we have sea glass. Guys, this is the final one, and I think this is the winner, by the way. So I decided on the sea glass, and then the Prussian blue. And then, what did I do, do you think? Ball gown. And, yeah, tell me, do you guys want more voiceovers like this, or just, no? just natural it is more work actually to do this um because there's a lot of editing and then i um like speed up some boring parts and stuff so but you tell me i mean i can't see how this is better than just like watching me putter around but who knows some people don't like me talking at all would you rather i just have music there's that black and not talk at all you tell me I know, everyone has an opinion, right? Um, all right, let's see how the final blow goes. Okay, good start. Yep, all right. No. No. Eh, okay. Yeah, I really should have thinned my cell activator looking at it this way. <laughs> Just a little bit. It's not bad. It's just like a little much, you know? Okay. Yep. I do. I'm really enjoying that purple color with the sea glass and the black. I think it looks really nice. Anyways, but let's see what you guys think of the final. You guys will be the judge of the final color combo. I had to, I, I hated, I had to work really hard for this one. Look at all the ones that I scraped on the way to get this one. So I hope you guys think like this is the winner. You know what I mean? Here she is in the light. Look, it's just really rich and I'm kind of happy with it. Thank you guys so much for joining. Like, subscribe comment do your thing all my information is in the description for more videos and stuff i love you guys have a good day bye